Hello and welcome everyone. I'm Nick. Let's go to you our journeys. Episode 2, Growing the Staff. We are not making any noise. Are you kidding? You can barely hear the music. I'm sorry, but you need to forget the property right away. This can't be. This is insane. Not for you. Take him. Impose myself. No. Excuse me, officer. Do you hear a bothersome noise level? Oh, uh, well, I have to admit that I don't right now. Only a second ago, the place sounded like an electronic music festival. What? That's not true. This is just the opening of a restaurant. Do you have the necessary permits? Not yet. That's why it's a private event. And I swear, we weren't making any more noise than what you hear now. What do you have to say about this? Well, actually, my report was more preventative in nature. Preventative? I'm sorry for bothering you. Something tells me we're going to have to be careful with you. You create the problem and you want to be careful with you? Yeah, blame him. Attention everyone! The time has come to enjoy dessert served by the owners. Could we take some photos of the successful couple? Of course! What kind of photos should we do, honey? The kind of what people want. Babe, give me a kiss on the cheek. On the cheek, not on the mouth. Let's give off the image of a family restaurant we made with love. I agree. The people will love seeing you together. I want to buy a few cases of your wine for my restaurant. I think they pay perfectly with one of my star dishes. Why don't you grow your own wines? Everything was incredible. This place will be a success. I promise you that. I'll take you for your word. Congratulations again, Katie. We promise to come often. Isn't that right, Phoenix? Of course, to remember the delicacies of the island. Okay, that too. Let's make a toast. Open another bottle. It's getting late. Let's take some selfies. Yeah, let's create more noises. Wait, let's take one together to put in my restaurant. That would be an honor. You did good for that prevention, you. Goodbye, let me know when you get to New York. Goodbye everyone, come back soon. And now, we'll have our own private celebration with you or not. I'm Pete. I thought it's a private celebration for you too. Luckily, everything went marvelously. Yeah, I'm happy about that. And I can't imagine a better way to celebrate that with a night of incredible sex for a new kid. First, we could heat up the evening a bit for play. Interesting. What do you propose? I could give you with a strip tease if you ask me for it passionately. What if she doesn't ask passionately, Adam? Aren't you gonna do that? I'd love that! Ready to be turned on? I'll put some music for the show. Oh wow, what a music. That's it! Let's take it all off slowly. That's too fast, Adam. She said slowly. Do you like what you see? I love it! And I love you! Kiss me! I can't wait any longer! And what if I don't? What are you suggesting, you naughty boy? 
What if I just slide my tongue across your body? Please, just do it already. She's impatient. I explore every curve of your soft skin, but not your mouth. Why must you tease me like this? Because your lips only deserve the finest of chocolates. Ah, I can't stand it any longer. Take me! So you're a chocolate, Adam? Good morning, sexy. Good morning, beautiful. It was so lovely holding you while we slept all night. I have an idea to have an incredible start to the day. Another one? Are you suggesting a round two? Two? I'm pretty sure that this is round four. What? So let's see how many more you can take. So are you strong enough for that, Adam? Phone. Perfect timing. It's a message from Adrian. He wants me to go to the restaurant right away. Hi Adrian, what's going on? Tell me it's not bad news. Why does it have to be bad news? Not at all, it's very good. I'm trying to prepare everything for the grand opening tomorrow. And the phone is ringing off the hook. Everyone wants to reserve their spot. I've been getting several messages for the same thing. I wish it was just several. Everyone wants to be here. Two people in Greenport, folks from New York, Four famous friends, everyone! Which famous friends? It's a good start! It certainly is, but we can't handle all of this! We need some help urgently! So, the staff is only you two? Wow, so who's the waiter? I understand, but where could we find someone right now? You could post something on your social media? Good idea, I'll post it right now! What should I write? What kind of person am I looking for? I'm looking for someone responsible. It doesn't matter to start tomorrow. Yeah, I'm looking for someone responsible. Well, I'll put... Hello everyone! I'm looking for someone responsible who has experience. Preferably culinary experience. To work in my new restaurant in Greenport. Proven work history, seriousness, and good customer service. Great! Done! Post it! Now, time to wait. So, who wants to be abused by Katie? None. I'm swamped. I'm sorry. I can't look at a single candidate more. Me neither. Plus, no one has convinced me. If they don't talk too much, they're too quiet or have a bad personality. And the only person that applied couldn't start until next month. What do we do? We only have one more person. Let's cross our fingers and hope we like them. Bringing in the last applicant, please. Ah, it's you. Sky, what are you doing here? Applying for the job. I would like to apply for the job. If it's as a host, waitress, assistant, or whatever, I need work. I haven't had money since breaking up with Omar. Do you have any experience? Of course, I was a secretary before getting married. And when I was younger, I worked as a waitress. Really? I didn't know that. It's true. I have experience and I'm very organized. You can ask Adam for that. I think this could work. The truth is that someone we already trust would be perfect. So you trust Sky? Alright, you're hired, Sky. Hired! You're exactly the type of person we're looking for. A person who wants to work and perfect themselves. Kitties, good afternoon. My name is Sky. How can I help you? How many? Perfect. I'll take note of the reservation. Thank you. Goodbye. Starting work already? I can't take it any longer. Tell me that the workday is finally over. Complaining much? 
It's not even your first day yet. How's the number one business women in Greenport? I'm looking forward to sleeping with you. Me too. You have no idea how much I was looking forward for this moment. You seem very relaxed. Totally. Hiring Sky will leave me of a lot of work. And it clear my mind of additional worry. So I'm all yours. Come to me. We have the entire night to ourselves. Yes, please. Mom! Dad! Now what's going on? Another teddy problems? What's wrong, honey? Why are you yelling? Someone ate my muffin! Oh, sweetie, you almost scared us half to death for a muffin. I'm sure it was your father. It wasn't me. It must have been Batacue. It wasn't Batacue. He was with me. So did you ask him? Well, I'll find something else for you to eat. This isn't possible. What? There's food missing from the pantry. You keep lock of everything? Don't look at me. Dad? Maybe you took some stuff to the restaurant or you forgot to restock? No, no. There's a lot missing. Ask Adrian. He's been here. What was that noise? There's a robber in the house! A robber stealing muffins? That's new! Thank you everyone for watching! Have a wonderful day! Don't forget to subscribe to my channel! And see you guys on our next journeys!